It's time again for our Drummer Nation Live. If you make music by hitting something, though you're playing it, whatever style, whatever genre, whatever level, this is the place for you. We've got a holiday show today. I think you're going to dig, and we're going to get rolling as soon as I get out of this box. Stay with us. Here we go. It's time for Drummer Nation. Introducing the Star Festival snare drum from Gary Astrich, a handcrafted and precision replica of the rarest and most iconic of drums. Ringo Starr's 1963 Ludwig Jazz Festival. Each instrument is authorized and hand-signed by Ringo Starr and will benefit his charity, the Lotus Foundation. Our latest innovation has opened the door for all drummers to have the same access as top musicians in the world. Custom Cymbals, now available to everyone. Your next sound just got more interesting. Sabian Custom Shop. Okay, with that, we're live, and I want to thank everybody for watching. I have a great holiday show today. It's a little repeat of some things you've seen before. Worth seeing again. Hey, we do Christmas and Kwanzaa and Hanukkah and Solstice and all that every year, so I have a cool big band holiday performance from a buddy that you're going to dig. But before that, I'd like to talk about a Christmas wish list for the drummer in your life. And I wanted to get that rolling now. Uh, hello. Okay. Looks like we had a hiccup there, but we'll keep rolling. Let me switch off of that on to something else. See if that does any better. Bada bing, bada boom. All right. We're good. Uh, my favorite line from Spaceballs, even in the future, nothing works. <laughs> But we do the best we can. All right. The Holiday Gift Guide this year is all about books. Here's a great new book called Buddy Rich, One of a Kind by Pele Berglund. And uh, it's got a forward by Max Weinberg, who you know from uh, Bruce Springsteen and uh, what did he do? Conan, one of the television shows. He was the MD4 for a long time. Anyway, I'm in the middle of reading it. It's a great Great read. If you're a drummer and you don't know about Buddy Rich, you need to. He's maybe arguably the greatest drummer who ever lived, and he was a monster when he was a child. So his childhood goes back to vaudeville, through the big band era, and uh, some of the best stuff he did was later on in his life. So it, it, it's a monster book on a monster drummer. I highly recommend you check it out. here, And it's on Hudson, Hudson uh, Publishing. Here's their spot for it. Okay, like I said, I'm reading the book now, but and I'll have a full review of it early in the next year, but uh, I think that spot tells you more about it than I can. And all I can say is if you have a drummer in your life, get him or her that book, and they will thank you for it. Uh, another thing on the wish list for drummers is a book I'm reading by Bobby Morris, also on Hudson, and um, 
let me let you look at the spot for that because this guy goes way way back to the early early years and he ended up being mr las vegas and elvis's music director his career spans all kinds of stuff and a lot of people weren't aware of him his name is bobby morris here's a little more about that It's a bit shorter of a spot, but you can't go wrong with books, I don't think, for the, uh, the drummer in your life. Most of them are able to read, you know, without moving their lips. Can read books without pictures. <laughs> so there are pictures in these books. Uh, there, there is another book I'm trying to remember the title of. Uh, I want to recommend. Oh, here it is. It's my book, Contemporary Linear Drumming, also on Hudson digital and you can check that out at hudson.com or hudsonmusic.com or whatever it is you'll find it uh so my recommendation is for books uh now i have another piece i want to show you just a short show it's a holiday show we're going to be out of here for the rest of the year pick it up next year but don't forget we have a lot of new shows coming your way drummer nation is expanding into drummer nation network a place for drummers where you will see the Drummer Nation interview shows. Uh, Paul Krabic is up now. I think by the end of the week, I'll be posting Danny Serafin, the great drummer from Chicago, the original Chicago band and the city. Uh, Drummer Nation Live is what you're watching now. Uh, we have another show that's had one episode so far, Classic Conversations, hosted by Steve Bryant, who is the owner and publisher of Classic Drummer Magazine. And he has a lot of video in the vault from articles that appeared in print that have never been seen, some of them done by yours truly. That's another show. One of them's already out. Johnny Vidakovich, the great legendary New Orleans drummer who has his own manner of speaking and is so... Uh, unique and uh, everybody loves Johnny so I thought Johnny Vidakovich unscripted we have two in the can he's done one I'm gonna put the other one up this week and then not, last but not least my buddy Mike Snyder who is a an e-drum guru so the show is appropriately named the first episode will be up look for them this week uh, one of all five of those shows, the idea is that they'll each air twice a month. So there's 10 shows a month for you to catch up with, and I think you'll dig them. Let's catch a couple of more spots before we move on. These Regal Tip Session sticks feel great. They kind of put me in the mindset of a thinner and lighter 5A. Go to regaltip.com, order a pair, or go to your nearest music store. Pick up a pair and let us know exactly how you feel about the stick. Hi, this is Stanton Moore. I've been playing and teaching drums for over 30 years. My new site, Stanton Moore Drum Academy, is the perfect online drum learning platform for any level drummer to learn how to play the drums the same way I did. I'm looking forward to seeing a lot of you as subscribers on the site, and I think we're going to have a lot of fun. And a lot of fun you will have on that. Let's see if we have any... Uh... Any participants in the chat room here? Not chat room, but the comments. No comments. If you want to comment, please do. I can post it live, or you can always email me, uh, michael at drummernation.com or info at drummernation.com, uh, and we'll take it from there. Now, the next thing I want to show you is a holiday performance of a big band chart. You'll recognize the music. It's a great chart, and we found it in one of Peter Erskine's books. It's a play-along, so you can pick up the book. You'll see it listed in the in the performance there, and um, and play it yourself. There's so many ways to record it yourself now. But John Cushon, which you're going to hear about in a second, came into our studio and blew this out in a first take, and it's a holiday favorite. Check out John Kushan, and this is a, a little bit of my show from a year or two ago where I introduce it. I think you'll dig it. Hi, everybody. This is your Drummer Nation host, Michael Vosbein. This is going to be a quick holiday show. So happy holidays to everyone. That means Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah, Happy Kwanzaa. Some people celebrate the solstice. That's cool, too, man. Whatever you need, make it a happy holiday season. So I'm resurrecting an older video. This is a uh, Christmas big band chart from an Erskine book. It's a play-along that a buddy of ours, a, a great artist, 
did a few years ago for us when he was visiting our Crescent studio. And uh, his name is John Cushon. Uh, he's a great drummer. More people should know who he is, but he happens to be married to the wonderful singer Olita Adams, and he works pretty much exclusively for her. So this is a great chance to see a, a, a great pro drummer in action that you may not be aware of, certainly deserving of more attention. Uh, in this case, you came into the studio, he had this play along, we set him up, got the headphones on him, and he kicked it out in one take, in five minutes he was gone. So a super pro doing a super job. Happy holidays. We'll see you on the flip side. Enjoy.
doesn't put you in the spirit you're probably never going to be I love hearing that every time for those of us who came up in the big band method big band approach there's nothing like a big band and if you're a young drummer you can get a lot of lessons from watching John I'll give you one little point whenever I play live uh, young people always say man you switch from sticks to brushes or back and I never saw how it happened it just happens well there's your lesson in how it happens the key is one hand at a time <laughs> something you have to work up it's a little housekeeping you have to do but if you do it right it's flawless and John Kushan is a master pro who sat down and killed it so I love hearing that every year I hope that's brightened your day uh, let me do a few more uh, this is what they call calls to action right first thing is please sign up for our newsletter at drummernation.com and you'll see a form that looks like that and when you fill that out you will get a link to download a paper I did a white paper on social media for artists especially drummers okay you can also check us out at patreon you know the deal there that's a crowdfunding thing where you can pledge like like public radio you pledge a dollar two dollars five dollars a month it hits your cards you never know what happened and uh, it helps me out quite a bit so the other thing I'd like to ask you to do is whatever you're watching this on hit the share the like the favorite the uh, uh, what subscribe whatever that button is on wherever you're watching this along those lines I've got some comments I'm reading here uh, hey Janelle Jerry, I like the Buddy Rich book quite a bit. I'm not finished with it, but I'll give you a, a full report early next year. Uh, and Chris Gordon, how can we get this video to broadcast through Chattanooga Area Drummers Group? You just send me an email, man, at info at drummernation.com. And Facebook allows you to cross-post. So a lot of people are watching this right now on other things than Drummer Nation. And I would be delighted to have it cross-post to your page as well just hit me up and it's a little simple code nothing to it nothing to it all right I think that's about it for today's show other than to wish everybody a happy holiday season whatever it is you celebrate all of the celebrations are about people coming together and loving one another and uh, I don't know anybody against that so uh, have a great holiday season and uh, sign up for the newsletter especially and we'll send out messages about these new shows that will all be up by the end of the week. It's five new shows counting this one. So with that I'm going to scroll the list. If you were asking about cross-posting, here's a list of the places that sometimes or all the time or 
have cross posted and then we'll take it into the out credits uh and the bumper okay see you on the flip side in 2020 and may it be a wonderful year for everyone thanks a lot everyone take care